Mr. Bennett, it is a truth universally acknowledged that a young man in possession of a large quantity of drugs who comes into A&E with blood streaming down his face from a large head wound is necessarily in need of immediate medical attention. Now put down that knife and let me examine you. Yeah, Lizzie, what do you think of this then? Real lace. It, it's a Spanish tablecloth. My brother brought it home from that there shipwreck down at Land's End. He goes out with the pirate ships, you know. They bring some all sorts of things. Lace. <laughs> Perfume. Gold coins. Backy. Oh, I loves him, you know. I'd do anything for him if he was to say to me, here, go jump in the River Tamer and swim right through to Plymouth Harbour. I'd do it just for him. No matter how many pasties i just eaten. <laughs> Honestly, Katie, I'm at me wit's end. I can't take any more of it. He sits there every day in front of the telly. He's smoking, he's drinking, he's stinking. He tries to make out he's disabled, but he's got enough strength to hit me and the kids. And he's out there playing footy with his brother and down the betting shop. I've got three jobs, you know. In the mornings I'm cleaning, afternoons I'm at Tesco, and at night time I'm a barmaid, and I still can't make ends meet. How are you, Katie?